Sainers catch large amounts of tuna by encircling schools of tuna with long and deep nets. This video looks at and identifies the main parts of a tuna per saner in action. It is useful for training Pacific Island fisheries observers. From the crow's nest or lookout, crew members keep a lookout for floating objects flocks of birds or debris that may be associated with schools of tuna. A helicopter helps with the search for floating objects, birds and debris. The net is hauled on board using a large hydraulic power block. A net skiff is used to hold the net while the saner encircles the net. It also helps pull the saner away from the net during hauling to prevent it from getting tangled in the net. The purse winch pulls a cable that runs through purse rings attached to the bottom of the net. As the cable winds back onto the drum, it closes the bottom of the net. The long net is stacked on deck with float line on one side and the chain line on the other side. This is a typical work deck on a persena. This is the recommended safe work area for observers during fishing and brailing operations. The tuna catch is preserved in cold brine wells on the wet deck. Electronic instruments on persenas are located in the wheelhouse. These typically include sonar, fish finder, radio, GPS, and other electronics. Observers record information on this gear and electronics while on board.